Swing us out, rap. I'm Nile Rogers, producer extraordinaire from the group Sheik, and give it up to Kayvon TV. In the house. This is the second encounter with Mr. Nile Rogers. How have you been at, uh, since? I'm good, man. Chilling. Hanging in there. One chart topper after the next. How do you do that? Is it so difficult? The truth is probably when I was a kid, I took a lot of LSD, and they said that if you take a lot of LSD, it's going to result in permanent chromosome damage. I would urge anyone who's listening to this, don't try LSD. <laughs> now let's quickly get to the first question here, because uh, we've got all the 15 minutes to do it. But you can do it, anybody. If anybody I'm, I'm can do it, your, your cheers, metabolism mate. is like that, Thank man, you, mate. so it's Thank cool. you. What do you think of the new Duran Duran album, Red Carpet Massacre? Well, I'm a huge Tim Timbaland fan, so... Of course. I'm already down, and of course I'm a huge Duran fan. Yeah. Even sans Andy Taylor. Well, see, I'm a huge, huge, huge Andy Taylor fan. Huge fan. Andy provides uh, a soul to the band that's really missing without him. What have you been producing lately? Have you been working on anyone's stuff uh, as of late? Just did uh, the video game Rock Band 2, and then earlier this year I had a really big soundtrack called Gears of War. What did you make of this? Uh, this guy's a phenom right now, Lil Wayne, and he's, he's, uh, he's being amazing. nominated for like eight Grammys. What do you think of this Lil Wayne character? He's... I think Lil Wayne is incredible. Lil Wayne is sort of in the tradition of like a David Lee Roth. When, when, when Dave used to roll into the room, it was party time. When oh, yeah. Wayne walked on the stage, <laughs> It's just party time. He's <laughs> killing him. His grooves are amazing, and he's, he's amazing. He's unbelievable. I'd like to get a quick shout out. All I need you to do is say, I'm Nile Rogers, and this is Kate. I'm Nile Rogers. <laughs> okay. And you are watching Aux TV. I'm Nile Rogers from the Group Chic, and you're watching Aux TV. And I'm Kate, and you're watching Aux TV. <laughs> All right. All right, man, you got it. Ox, cheers, right, mate. Peace. Take it easy. Okay. Uh, it's a, it's a, my favorite chair. Uh, it's Mr. Glenn Say there. How are you, buddy? Uh, can I shake your hand, sir? Piss off, will you? Oh, that's very rude. I just was told to piss off on camera by none other than Slats, Glenn Sather himself. Did you get that on Audible? Piss off, will you? Yeah, we did, okay. That's no. okay, he's still my favorite, I don't care. Very abrasive personality, obviously, one of the greatest head coaches and general managers that, that, uh, that there was. Someone has seemed to access the mainframe of the computer and seemed to go on, on and type a bunch of gibberish on the site. This is just a start from Expletive Deletive Community. From the Expletive Deletive Community based in New York, we are determined to expose you as a con artist, threat for Expletive Deletive Image, and exporting you to the Canadian government. Reporting me to the Canadian government, is that what, what you meant to say? Are you seriously mentally okay? We will chip in for your psychological delusional problems. If your pops had half a dignity, oh, nice one, he would have kicked the living expletive deletive out of you. Please know that you're not funny at all. Your looks are just repulsive at best. And in short, you have no talent. Buy an expletive deletive clue. This expletive deletive won't get you laid. If it won't get me laid, then what will get me laid? Do you have any suggestions to get me laid? Because if this expletive deletive isn't working from a talentless, mindless person like me, then what can work? How about we just hang up the cycle all of a sudden? We just let things go all of a sudden, let it fly out the window. Maybe I should pick up my cell phone and dial everybody on my contacts just to tell them what kind of a person I am, what an evil bad person I am. On second thought, maybe not. I think I just broke my cell phone because of you. I will take it into consideration. I will make adjustments and change certain styles. Maybe make it a little more appealing. What I will not change, and I absolutely will not step down from, is my platform of being who I am. If you want to see Cave on TV, go ahead. It's public. Anyone can see it. It's for the masses. It's for the general public. It appeals to everybody. If I want to stick my face right in front of this fan and talk like this the whole time, sounding like some sort of sci-fi character, I can do that too, but however, I choose to speak in my normal voice. This is what I am. This is who I am. If you can't bloody well accept that, then I'm sorry, mate. You probably got the wrong person. I think you mean someone else. Maybe you, you were after somebody else with my name. There's a lot of k out there too. k a very unique name. Hey, what's up? I'm from Hill Scarlet, and I have to tell you, what's your name, bro? It's k -Von. It's It's k -Von. I love yeah. him. I love yeah, him. I love real, you. I love you. Get a real job. Hey folks, how are you? Welcome back. I'm here at the uh, uh, downtown Toronto, Ontario hotel of uh, the uh, band Judas Priest right now, uh, waiting for um, the arrival of my good friend Mr. K.K. Downey. That's the bill right there, and let's go over to the uh, Len Tipton, the first to come off the bus. Mr. Tipton, sir, I would like to get a shout out for, uh, for you for my uh, internet channel, Cave On TV. Just say hi, I'm Glenn Tipton, this is Cave On, and you are watching... Hi, Tipton. I'm Glenn Tipton, this is Cave On. That's it. And you're watching Cave On TV? You're watching Cave On TV. There you go. Here comes Mr. Ian Hill right here. Ian Hill, the bass player, uh, 
for the Judas Priest. The leather clad bass player, of course. Don't they all wear leather? It's a fantastic show, really, Mike. Thanks. Can I get a quick uh, shout out from you for my uh, web channel, Cave On TV? Just say, hi, I'm Ian Hill, Judas Priest. This is Cave On. I'm Cave On, and you're watching Cave On TV. Hello, this is Ian Hill from Judas Priest, and this is K1, and you're watching K1 TV. But, cheers, thank you very much. It's actually K1 TV. The British Steel album was really the album that personified uh, Judas Priest. The songs from the album was also performed tonight. I, I loved it. I mean, it was a great show from start to finish. Scott Travis, ladies and gentlemen. Why are they filming you? I've got a web channel called K1 TV. Your what? My web channel called K1 TV. KK Danny was also on K1 TV. Can I get a couple of photos with you before you uh, get me? Yeah, you're Aussie. Strange. I'm not an Aussie. Strange looking Aussie. Oh, well, hold on, I'm an Aussie then. Cheeseburgers. <laughs> Where are you from, Germany? Uh, no, England. France? Just kidding, dude. I know you're from. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Should we do a promo for K-Von TV? K-1 TV? K-Von. K-Von TV. Just say hi, K I'm Scott Travis of Judas Priest. Avon TV? K- Avon? Yeah, Avon. yes, yes. Scott Travis for Avon TV. <laughs> K-Von right? TV. All oh, right. All right, there we go. I know that voice. <laughs> I know that voice very well. I must say, oh, I your thing that. with the, uh, the, the Terminator, the what was Terminator. it? Terminator. Oh, that, that, that was killer. That was oh, killer. Thank that you. was you... red, red heart. And you heard that I'm from one of the greatest guitar <laughs> players of all time, Mr. KK Downing. That oh. is an honour. That's a privilege. Boy, I nearly shat myself with laughing. <laughs> thank you so much, Arnie. Can I take a picture Honest, with you? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, can you take a picture? <laughs> <laughs> Can I take a picture? Thank you. 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 30 years on the anniversary That's of, right, of British, British Steel. That's right, British Steel, the album, it's yeah. Like so many people were like, you know, 12, 13, 14, 15, all in the teens, lots what, of people. What year was it, 19? It was like 1980. That was the year I was born, folks. Yeah. British Steel was made the year I was born. Ironic. So what's he doing here? <laughs> it's not a part in the nostalgia team. It's not in the band Judas Priest, but he's here. Look at the get-up. What can I say? And he gets everywhere. He's just like herpes. Got to be persistent. Right. Cheers, Mr. K.K. Downing, making his return to Cave On TV. And I'd like to thank Mr. K.K. Downing uh, for being a big fan of Cave On TV as well. I've been up a long time. I mean, I've just gone to the concert. I'm just going to retire. So, good night. I'm going I'm to I'm um, just go to sleep here. Yeah. Bugger off now. I'm going to sleep. Body drop the wood. 